Hello everybody and welcome back to the shitcast rated number one in all of Argentina. Yes, Bell, you, you heard that right. Yeah, we, we made it, we did it. We're international, we're everywhere. I'm your co-host Rev, and joining with me today, I actually don't have anybody. This is actually recorded on April Fools and this whole entire podcast that is being uploaded right now. It's, uh, it's just going to be me. It's just going to be me talking the whole time. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, hopefully you guys will, you know, stay tuned for everything that I got to say for the next hour and a half. Um, what to say, what to say. So everything that's been leading up to this moment has been wonderful for me. I, I love my friends. I love everybody in the Weeb Center and the, the shit cast in general. So hopefully you guys can spread some love and some positive. Okay, I can't do this anymore. Oh, okay. Anyway, guys, I'm recording a little bit earlier as usual um we usually have times and stuff for the shit cast or whatever but the thing is with this with this podcast i'm by myself i'm recording this by myself but i also pinged everybody so whoever joins joins so y- you guys are not going to know who actually joins the the shit cast until you know they actually join and the thing about this is because i said to celebrate the 10th episode we're just going to uh, just say whatever. We're just going to have a casual conversation. Usually, whenever we do that, we don't have any filter between each other. So, if there are some parts I need to censor and not cut out, just censor, then I probably would have to do that. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. These guys are not going to know whenever I start recording or whenever I stop recording. I just started recording as you guys are probably just watching this video or whatever. So, yeah, it's just... It's just something to um something to talk about but uh one of the first things i actually want to get out of the way was the uh the april fools video that i posted yesterday as of making this video i'm recording this on saturday i don't know if this will be uploaded on saturday or sunday just depends what i have to edit out what i don't have to edit out but um uh, yeah the couple of days ago hap just basically said that um he, he, he like he made a joke because of the a one Roblox game called Fart Attack, and we were playing Roblox or whatever, and we were just, and it's like, oh, this is a Fart Attack. This reminds me of Heart Attack. You know, your BYB rev, and it's just like, yeah, funny, funny BYB, yeah. And so, um, I I got the idea from that. I was just like, should I actually just troll everybody because of the whole TRR stun or whatever? So, yeah. I decided to make the fart attack cover or whatever. Gary was very skeptical whenever, um, yeah. Fuck you. Sorry, Bell. I was just talking to myself. You know how I'd be sometimes. Yeah. But, um, uh, whenever Gary made that, uh, that that cover art for me that fart attack he was very skeptical and he was just like oh what the fuck uh, I, I guess I'll do it so Gary just did it just to do it what time is it over there for you Bell? like 4.54 Four fi- oh damn I didn't know you were that far ahead of me jeez it's only 2.54 right now Bell, where's James? Yeah, he's not here. <laughs> show, him, <laughs> show him to me. He's not here, but like, here's another dog. Where I am, she looks like James, but women. But women. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> God damn. Rush that bitch. It is a, what the hell? Why was she doing that? Girl, oh, that James. Oh. This is the only dog I fought. What? 
I don't like how you're standing behind her. Dog. All right, Bell. I got a question for you. Yeah. If, if you can fuck any flavor of Pop Tart, what would it be? Say that again. If you could fuck any flavor of Pop Tart, what would it be? The Forest Papers Pop Tart, my favorite. I think I've only had the s'mores once. Like I, I, I usually don't eat pop tarts that much. No, the Hap was saying that he likes cherry the most, and I was just like, "What the fuck?" I didn't. I've never. I, I didn't even know there was a cherry flavor. But uh, yeah, before uh, Bell joined, whenever I was just explaining shit, um, I just wanted to bring up the whole TRR thing. Yes, TRR is a real thing. It is my YBB. And yeah, it's going to be really fun. It's going to be really cool to make. I already got some animators and some editors for it. I didn't. The only reason why like I didn't really want to start a YBB was one, I didn't have like the right matchups. So I wanted to have very unique and non-repeated matchups, but the but BBP and uh, JT just well BBP was just forcing me to let him in TRR. He was just like, please, I'll, I'll do anything, I'll I'll do any. And he's like, oh, what about me and JT? JT, what, come on, come on, you gotta rematch me. And and they're just saying that like they didn't like that uh that that matchup in the first place from BYB. So yeah, so that's why they're doing. So that's why they're they were doing a rematch and that's why that's going to be the first episode and you know, you, you know from experience right all right bell like bell is going to be in trr yeah i'm not saying who she's against but hopefully. i against james <laughs> yes bell versus james how are you going to how are you going to diss james like that Yes. <laughs> All right. That's understood. the answer. Understood. But uh, uh, yeah, I'm only gonna have eight round ones, and the on, on only other reason as well was because my uh, everybody else in the Weep Center was just like, "Oh my God, Red, if you actually do a YBB, we'll actually come. Oh, we'll actually do matchups for you that you'll actually love." And I was just like, oh, shit, all right. And then they told me the matchups. I was like, oh, no, actually, no, they made, like, two matchups that I'm not going to say because they're going to be really cool. And I was like, you know what? Those matchups are cool. But if I can get the two matchups that I wanted, which are going to be so crazy, like, it, it, like once you look at these matchups, like, that, and once the episodes come out and you'll see who's facing who, you won't believe, like, how I actually got them in my YBB. So yeah, I got I got a verbal ace. <laughs> That's actually real. Anyway, verbal ace versus a baldy. No, just kidding. <laughs> but uh, Jesus Christ himself versus James. <laughs> I I I I'm, I I'd probably have to go with James. Same. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, uh, the first episode isn't finished because of Bell, so I'm going to start doing some <laughs> some scenes for myself. I usually don't edit shit, but, you know, some people just don't want to work on it. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh, yeah. <laughs> I'm talking about you, Amin. <laughs> I mean, I means, I mean, just helping me. Like, he's he's gonna just help me write scripts and shit. Hey, you're the picture here. Let's see, where are these bitches at? I said fifteen minutes. Gary and Ruben both like agreed to it, but they never said that they're that they're coming or not. 
Ruin just sent a fucking Stewie <laughs> gif. Just Stewie just. <laughs> So how was your week so far, Bell? Good. How good was it? What That's did, it. What did you eat for breakfast this morning? Nothing. You gotta eat breakfast. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Sherman ended up Gary's way. I don't eat breakfast because I don't want to. Do you not have breakfast at home? Like... I just woke up and no one, no one was home, so like. Oh, I see. That's the one thing about me. Like, I'll eat breakfast if I have breakfast stuff at my house. Like, if I have eggs or like cereal or whatever, like, I will definitely eat breakfast because I'm like, I gotta eat something in the morning because I'm not gonna wait until like 12 or 1 in the afternoon to actually eat. And sometimes. When I wake up. <clears throat> sometimes I do that in. That's only because, like, I have class from until, like, 12 or 1. So, I either eat between the both class periods because I don't have, like, a 10. It takes, like, 10 minutes. That's all I have for free time before I have to go to the next class. But usually, like, class will end early and then I'll walk to, like, fucking McDonald's or something. Because there's, like, a McDonald's and other fast food restaurants near my fucking school. like those those places are cool and all but like the this is like a local this is like a i go to a local university so usually like i only go for like associates or bachelors and the the other university is an actual university where it's like full-on bachelors doctorates masters all all that type of shit so it's a it's a bigger university and those motherfuckers have a Chick-fil-A and a Starbucks in their university. And I'm mad. Because I, I want that shit here. But we some cheap ass bitches. It's more, it's more expensive over there as well. Like tuition is like is like in the fucking five digits I think. The five, di five digit mark. So like ten thousand dollars minimum so so i was just like holy shit hell no my tuition every semester is like almost close to two grand actually no like fifteen hundred not not two grand i was being overzealous if that's the correct or the correct wording <laughs> oh what, what are you doing what are you, what are you what, what, nothing oh. i accidentally turned my camera on <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to show me something for a second. I'm going to show you the dog again if I, if I have to. Oh, but in the car. They're there. But in the car. Oh, that's James. <laughs> it's Blanca. That's not James. What the fuck? It is James. If I say it's James, it's James. James with... <laughs> James with the pussy. <laughs> James with the pussy. <laughs> You drive a key? Uh, no, that's not a key. That's a Fiat. What the hell? My grandpa's car. <laughs> not even his. From the the work. I thought it was like a golf cart or some shit. I don't know. Is Hap still streaming? I don't even know if Hap is still streaming or not. He was streaming earlier today, but let me see. Super Hapman fifteen. Oh, he is not. Of course, that's the first thing I get as soon as I pick up this shit. It's nothing but Burger Brawl in my suggestions. Okay. Burger Brawl. Burger Brawl. Burger Brawl. <laughs> God, I, <laughs> I don't even know if I want to do that Burger Brawl iceberg. It's going to take me so long. You do. Is it, <laughs> you will love to make one. <laughs> It's just, it took a month just for the HIB one, just getting all the information, writing down the script and shit. That, that, that was hard for me to do. Actually, I had fun writing the script. I just, it was, it just sucked editing all of it. That's, that's the one thing. There were part, there were like so many days where I could have just sat down and edited for hours, but I just didn't do it because I had no work. 
um, incentive to just sit down and just do it. And it wasn't until spring break for me where I actually just started sitting down and just started doing everything. And even then... Uh, you had to get out things because I'm even rub you. Yeah, yeah, I did have to take out those things, but that's all right. I don't really mind. It's still getting views or whatever. I wasn't expecting it to be like super popular, like 10k plus views, but you know, it's still pretty cool. It's still doing pretty good, better than more of my recent videos, which I still genuinely like, but still, I really like that. Hold on, how much does the the fart attack have? The fart attack troll. No fart attack. I still haven't. I still haven't. Uh, reverted it back to like the original. It, it still says TRR episode one. I I, do, I need to change the title and the thumbnail. Oh, five hundred views. Oh. This guy is so gay. <clears throat> Why does the last podcast have more views than more of the recent podcasts? That's me. Oh, that is true. But also, <laughs> that one clip of you saying daddy that you uploaded to your channel, it almost has as many views as the actual podcast itself. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's almost close to like 400 or some shit. Yeah. Fuck, I forgot that I was going to have to do a laundry today. I'll probably do it later, though. How often do you do your laundry, Bill? What? <laughs> you heard me. How often do you do your laundry? Years. Years? Yes. How many? Five. It's very specific, but you know, cool. In six months, with th seven minutes and three hours, <laughs> twenty seconds. What's the longest you've gone without showering? I don't fucking know. I don't remember. Uh, like five days. I'm thinking, like last year. Five days. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, well, Sora's here. Sora, do you want to answer the question, buddy? He's muted right now. What question? How, what's the longest you've gone without showering? Like, like two days, that's it. Two days? Come on, man. Like, come on. You don't want to say the, world record. I've been long, longer than two days without showering. I'm, it's disgusting. Like back when never I, I was with my dad for like um for like the summer or whatever, like I would hardly take any any showers over there. <laughs> I was only there for like a month or so, so like I took like about at least ten showers at max. Even though that that doesn't seem, but the longest I've gone without it, 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 it was a week. I've gone a week without showering, but. Damn. But, uh, disgusting, man. It is bad, but I was like 16, maybe? So, yeah, I was like 16. Whenever I did that. It's not that long ago. Yeah, I know it's not that long ago, but I'm just saying. Like, <laughs> actually, yeah, I, I was 16. I don't, I don't know. Man. Younger, I, I, a lot younger, I would understand, but no, but damn. I don't know, man. It was just like I would game all day, watch YouTube, watch other things, and then I'll go back to gaming. One. Uh, I I was talking about 
uh, Celestial Girls of My Little Pony, but you made me you made me have to say it out loud. Thanks a lot, Sora. Are you are you are you, are you recording yet? Uh, no. No one's gonna know. Yeah, no one's gonna know. I, I'm not telling you if I'm recording or not. Hold on, give me a second. I gotta. But I said. Be a flat lines. But I said three, so obviously. <laughs> oh, thank God, the left. Thank God, I, I'm I'm done. I'm I'm just tired. Of, I'm just kidding. Oh, I, I asked Bell the same question earlier, Asura. Um, this is a pretty serious question, but she still managed to answer it, so I wanted to get your input on it. Oh, God. If you can fuck any flavor of Pop-Tart, what would you choose? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck in a Pop-Tart? <laughs> hypoth hypothetically. Hypothetically. If you had to fuck off a specific flavor of Pop Tart, which would you choose? I don't know the fla I don't know the flavors off the top of my head to be. Okay, well, I'll, I'll, hold on. I'm looking it up right now. Uh, Pop Tart flavor. All Pop Tart. God damn, they got a whole site full of them. All right. Frosted apple fritter. Frosted Boston Cream Donut, Pop Tart Egg. Holy shit! That's a long ass list. Oh, those are Pop Tart. Yeah, who doesn't want to? Who doesn't want to stick a dick in some Boston cream? I don't know. <laughs> unfrosted Everybody strawberry. Loves that. Uh, uh, have you ever tried an unfrosted Pop Tart? <laughs> no. It sounds fucking disgusting. Well, oh, who eats the most I, I eat a lot Pop of these tarts for the fucking really frost. Gross. All these sounds so gross. What the fuck? Frosted cookies and cream, frosted hot fudge sundae, frosted raspberry. Fucking, fucking fruit loop pop tarts. Okay. Fr where's the fucking strawberry smoothie or strawberry milkshake one? I like those. Where's the penis often? Funny how he's just mentioned penis and then Rev asked me if I would fuck a pop tart. I said hypothetically. Okay, well, are we good? So is anyone else coming to the? I'm not too sure. G Gary and Ruben uh, like <laughs> agreed to it. Oh, what is that? Oh, Naughty's at work. Never mind. Naughty was typing and I was just like, oh shit. But. uh... Uh, uh, Ollie, what what about you? If you had to fuck, if you had to fuck a flavor of Pop Tart, what would you choose? What? <laughs> that was my reaction. <laughs> well, uh, uh, I'm searching a Pop Tart. Cake and some cake. I'm searching a Pop Tart. Uh, I, I searched up the same thing as well, and, and I'm on the website. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. We got freaking oh, yeah. mango. Okay, there's wild cherry, cookies and cream. I like it because it's black and white. Equal representation. <laughs> um, All right. I fucked the s'mores one. That's exactly what Belle said. <laughs> Yeah, this is funny because we don't we don't know when Rev's recording, so if some some shit like that ends up on the podcast. Marshmallow hot chocolate, what the fuck? Dude, this this shit look banging. Holy shit, I'm gonna put my dick in it. Oh. I'm on you in the dirt. You're gonna be your end like your mineral friend. Ice cream sandwich. Oh my gosh, these like where can I get these flavors? I want to like. I want to just like refrigerate them. You got chocolate, vanilla, cream. Refrigerate. Yes, refrigerate them. Because if it's an ice cream sandwich pop tart, I'm obviously gonna fucking. Oh put yeah, in... it's ice cream sandwich. Yeah. Yeah. But those, these are the ones I'm talking about. The fucking, uh, the strawberry milkshake ones. They look good, but holy shit, it's like it's so sugary that it kind of sucks. I've only had them one time.
watch the new Ollie Mohamdani YouTube video. Oh, did you actually upload? Hold on, let me check. Mm -hmm. It's an AYB related video. We will. I'm gonna get more AYB done if uh, if fucking Hydro would actually send FMT the um backgrounds he needs to animate it, but he doesn't. AYB, for, like, no reason. Yeah, I don't know it's why. quite the franchise. A CBB inspired YouTube review box battle seemed crazy at first, but to the height of what YBBs have become, AYB has been one of my most well received and mentally draining. Remember products. when you could add polls to the I cards? Oh, hell yeah, I remember YouTube that. Pen. Those were the good ass days. Started in July of 2020, AYB started off. Right, I have a serious question for y'all. Do you guys just randomly start scrolling yeah, through but... your old community posts and just think of the memories or the position you were in when writing those? <laughs> yeah. No, no, we usually when I scroll through people's posts with my name in them, I don't, I kind of get pissed off, so I try not to do that. No, I mean like, I mean like your own posts. Yeah, I still don't. I remember we're just, yeah, like, my, my community post was just nothing but polls asking people what, what the next cover of like the CBB character they wanted I, me to I do know, next. I know, I am I remember like the first uh the first time I started watching Rev he made a he made a community post about me. Yes, I did. I'm going to try to find it. I made a post yeah, about some members old. I remember yeah. store members all this post with my name in them. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking good times. That was good times. Uh, damn bro, why do you upload? Why do you make so many polls? Because, yeah, I don't man, even think I can scroll through all. I don't think I can scroll through all my posts. I've had my mind for like nearly three years. This woman might make me act up, and then there's a picture of Kermit. <laughs> God damn it! I oh. forgot about oh, that. On 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 December thirty first this year, I would have had mine for like fucking three years. But yeah. Because I've, I've had it for so long, I don't think I can scroll through all of my posts. I, I still, I'm gonna, like, still determined to find I don't know, the, I haven't tried um, to scroll through my posts, I make too, I make too many dumb, dumb ass This officially might community. be, this officially might be the best night of my life. Verbal Ace, and above Verbal Ace, Super Sam. <laughs> I didn't even see oh, what that. The I didn't even see that. <laughs> Friends of Nation. Oh, yeah. I thought back, though, I tried to scroll on my own post. My new series revolves around a 14 year old kid named Josh. For all these okay, Josh. This makes AYB, oh. along with MBO, being the only two YBB to update. Oh my god. Most men are straight today because of her, and there's a picture of Lola Bunny. Yes, that's true. And oh here my we are god. now with the latest episode. My sub count, Hydro's sub count. How the hell have I not, have I not made a post in two days? What the fuck? I barely use this shit anymore. Me either. I barely upload in general. I remember when I when I was using when I was making like fucking five posts a day. Now I now I make like two a week. Uh, let's see. Hey! Oh my god. What? Um. That whole verbal A situation with you, Rev. Oh yeah, I remember that. Okay, what happened? Now it's to be super like, basic like, and say, take down your video oh. or something. What? Did he like take down your video? Oh no, I just made a video of like the, of just like funny comment compilations of like throughout the CBB or whatever, and so that that blew up. That got like over like two hundred, like three hundred thousand views in like under like a month or so and the thing was i just made it randomly like whenever i first made it it only had like probably like 14 or 15k and then suddenly out of nowhere just it just started blowing up and it did it happened i think it was like either january or february of last year and so i i like the thing that happened was that ace like commented on that video saying that i didn't give him credit and the thing was like like I said, I just made it randomly, and of course, like I, I didn't.
put like his name at the beginning like I usually do. But that was only because before then I would credit Ace every single video. So I guess for that video, I just thought like people already knew who he was. So I don't know. I kind of felt guilty about it. So that's so that's why I, I took that video down. And I made that uh, that apology like he didn't do anything or whatever, but he still uh, accepted my, the apology or whatever. Oh. You, the, one, the one video you don't, you, the one video you don't credit Ace is the one that you see. Yeah, that, that was. Go subscribe to Ali Mohammadani if you haven't. This man literally hit 2K just a couple weeks ago and he's almost a 3K. That's absolutely wow, insane. Great he box, deserves bro. support. Yeah, I do. Wow, great beatbox, bro. Shut up! Great beatbox. Okay, 3K. I thought I'd only be done. Okay, now I'm supposed to be super basic um, and say, wow, great beatbox, Rev. Okay. I really shouldn't be. Like wow, my what? Shut up! Stopped. Wow, I don't know how far I go into my own posts. What? Why did the post stop? What post stop? Let me go see. Let me go see the one from October. What? This is BS. Oh yeah, I think it's like wow, some five months, five months ago. I complained about the community tab change. Okay. Oh, it's only because like uh, those f like five hundred people, like five hundred subscribers, and you can make community posts or something like that. Or what was it about? Yeah, I remember. Yeah, I, I don't remember why I complained about it so much, but I remember not liking it. God damn! This old man, uh, okay, old man Sora, just my... being all cranky. I'm gonna search through my community posts. Uh, just me complaining about the community for like 10 years. Uh, when does this end? When does this end? Oh my god. There's some HYB, AYB quote. <laughs> what the hell? I've been summoned. Hello, Ruben. Oh. oh there's I didn't think we were going to say Ruben today. <laughs> I don't really anything, I, anything I want to say? Yeah, you uh, can say anything you want, buddy. I can finally say a bunch of offensive. Ju no, just kidding. I'm not gonna do that. I wouldn't risk it in case we're recording. I'm just. Dude, kidding. I kind of want to remake the FRAF cipher, cipher. To be honest. Oh, uh, Ollie, I'm looking through your. Po I'm looking through your your community post right now. Why the fuck does Hat versus Mason want to be the next episode people see, and not me versus Gary? Now you versus Gary is next. Yeah, but this was like because three months Hap ago. never finished. He made me wait. I'm also Over waiting on Hap. So I'm also waiting on Hap, so like... And didn't Hap like quit HIV though? Uh, yeah, he did. But like, um... He, he, said, he, said, he's not he said he's not quitting against you, so like... Wait, so what's gonna happen? Does Javon move on? Oh no, I I'm pretty sure if like the time comes to it, where like it, the the loser round, like is gonna reach the second round of the loser round, I guess I'm pretty sure he's just gonna do it and then just leave again or something like that. I'm pretty sure he's just gonna make the performance, probably catch a W because it's KMM, and then just probably leave again or not. Yeah, I don't know. It, was, it was supposed to be against KMM. Yeah. Ugh. Why oh, burping so much? Holy shit. I remember Darn Man posts, bruh. Oh my oh my fucking god, I just found I just found these posts from when H2 first got fucking community posts meaning we're just roasting each other. Oh my god, when I got my my new fucking iPad, I thought it was the shit. R Ruben, what's your favorite Darman video? <laughs> my favorite Darman video? Yeah. I don't even know. I'm not the myth, the legend. My, it, I don't it, even. I don't even know. Makes fun of Darman gets mad to say it. That's so funny. <laughs> Mine was the Mr. Feast video. Mr. You, Feast. <laughs> they wouldn't allow him in the fucking store, and Mr. Feast who was just like, "I want to buy this whole store," and they're like, "No, get the fuck out." <laughs> Mr. Feast, bro. Get the fuck out my store. What if that actually happens to like the actual Mr. Beast, or like <laughs> he catches it on camera instead of like cutting off the people who kick oh him out of stores? Oh my god, I found Mr. so Mr. much. Beast meets Dom, man. real. I found so much. Uh, 
Drama. I want to see. I want to see. My God. I want to see Mr. Beast. I in, complained in a, about the drama in the TV community. I made it. In the in the what the fuck? What the hell, Sora? <laughs> what, what the hell is this? H two underscore zone this year, girl. Whoa. Oh my God. I just. I am conflicted. I don't know what to say to this. The fuck? Hey, this is when he first got fucking community post. One of the first things he did was roast my OC's head, so I had to fucking clap back. <laughs> didn't, okay. he, didn't, didn't he say it looked like a wait? Didn't he say it looked like a watermelon? <laughs> Some shit like that, yeah. <laughs> Ollie, I gotta ask, do you like watermelon? He said he was gonna, he said he was gonna get another revenge post, but he never posted it, so I declared what, myself what, the winner. What did he say, uh, Again. Do you like watermelon? I like fried chicken, watermelon, and purple Kool-Aid. That 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 explains it. Yeah. No, I'm kidding. I don't like any of those. You don't like any. You don't like chicken or or watermelon. No. And I don't like. I like those things, and I'm like. I like I like I like green grapes. I don't like green Kool-Aid. What about? How I like all three of those things. But Uh... I'm the watermelon warrior and the Kool-Aid crusader. Ruben, I gotta ask this question because I already asked everybody this question. Um, if you uh, if if you could fuck any flavor of Pop Tart, what would it be? What? 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 Like, what the fuck? Huh? It, did do you want me to repeat the question? Please. If you can fuck any flavor of Pop Tart, what would it be? The, um, I add to that question. Yeah. Why would you want to fuck a pop tart to begin with? It's it's hypothetical. Like in this scenario, you have to fuck it, and so in it, it, it just you have to do it, and then you have to pick a certain flavor because the people who are making you fuck the pop tart want you to be the nice. breakfast food. Yes. <clears throat> fuck! I don't even know. <laughs> Do you know Pop Tart flavors? Do you want me to Google it for you? That's why I sent that that strawberry milkshake Pop Tart earlier. Well, damn, that does look good. That one then. That one? Gosh, you're no fun. Yeah. You're no fun, dude. You don't want to search up Pop Tart what? flavors. Okay, hey, bro. You. Yeah. What's your favorite Avenger? My favorite Avenger. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Oh. Uh, probably. It would still be Iron Man, probably. Iron Man? Yeah, probably. Yeah, Tony's I don't, funny. I don't think I need to say an answer. Yeah, we already know it's Doctor Strange, bro. It's kind of bad, but... I don't really like Doctor Strange, to be honest. I want to see what the new movie is going to be about. It's new... about the, the yeah, events like... after No Way Home. No, no shit, but I'm just saying I want to see what it's going to be about. Like, what the hap. The, what the fuck? What the hype? Is gonna be about? Well, Wanda's the villain. Yeah, I guess. Okay, a big complaint I have about Infinity War is the characters they chose to be snapped and the ones they chose to stay. Of course, the original six got to stay, but the rest had to get like wh- why? And yeah, I guess War Machine, Ant Man, and like Nebula stayed, but like, wh- why couldn't they like keep some other people, like Black Panther? He just had a movie, and you already got rid of him. <clears throat> I guess he didn't feel so bad. It's because he's black. Yeah. Because he's black. I mean, even the War Machine stayed, but War Machine is considered an attack helicopter toaster strudel, so. Okay, Sora. What? I, I don't. I don't doubt this. I, I don't actually doubt this. That's the. That's the thing. This happened. Rev, did you... no? You're not gonna tell me. I was gonna ask if you started recording. 
I'm going to take a random picture. Of, oh, it's this dumbass shit. Did you start Did recording? You say you'd no. Fuck the strawberry milkshake Pop Tart. No, I never said that. I was just, um. Actually, I don't know. I think it would probably the blue be the blueberry. I don't know. Or or the, the brown cinnamon. This pod podcast isn't named after the p fucking the pop tart question. I will be disappointed. You turn me on like I like He's disappointed. Pop tart podcast. <laughs> We just talk about pop, back pop to the tarts. Pop -tart podcast. Is that a real thing? I want to look that up. If there's an actual podcast talking about pop tarts, and that's it. Why the hell? What the hell is this episode? Jesus Christ! Well, I got it. Like, we got to call this the we what gotta, the fuck episode. We got to talk about something, man. Pop, a uh, pop tart podcast. Oh, How are you looking this up for? I put pod ass. Damn it. I forgot to see. A podcast where we talk about ass. Sign me up. What the hell? Is, okay, it's not a Pop-Tart podcast, but the first thing that comes up is a Pop-Tart versus English Muffin, where Sal from Impractical Jokers comes on a podcast and talks about Pop-Tarts. <laughs> That's very random, but... Random. How, jokers moment. how to perfect how to perfectly cook a pop tart why does anybody want to know that do you do you guys eat pop tarts like room temperature or do you guys actually just like eat niger actually like eat it from like the toaster i don't know i've done both i can't say which one i've done more i don't know Okay, the real question is... Most of the time, most of the time I'll, the just eat it. I'll just eat it out of the box because I get impatient on the way home. The real question is... Bro, why did my sub count freeze, Have bro? you guys ever put butter on a Pop-Tart? Have you ever put Have butter on a Pop-Tart? That's why I asked. <laughs> Pop tart. If you haven't, then thank you. Yeah, haven't, then I thank you. Bro, we all know what that's from. Yeah, Family but that's from American Dad. Yeah, but I'm like, I'm being serious. Have you guys actually ever put butter on a pop tart, just to try it out? No. No. After I heard that song, that was the immediate first thing I did. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. It it tastes really good. It tastes pretty damn good. I actually have actually done it yet. I, I've they done say it. they're not lying. I, I've done it like maybe like four or five times it's like so they're not lying it actually done it twice and i'll do it do it again yeah i don't know how they came up with the fucking concept of just like you know let's just put butter on a pot tart why not even though it's supposed to be like a toaster pastry or whatever i don't know how much we're talking about pot tarts on this podcast dude i'll tell i'll tell you this like I used to love the the brown cinnamon sugar fucking pop pop tarts, but the thing about it is like I'll still eat it to this day. But it has so much like, I I don't know what's inside of it, but like the brown pop tarts, as soon as like I eat it, like not even like five or ten minutes later, every single time I have to shit. Like, it just it just fucks up my whole entire stomach. I don't know what's in it or what causes it. But I just have to shit every time I eat it. Like, not even that long after I actually eat the Pop-Tart. Yeah. Speaking of Pop-Tarts, you know... How's life been? <laughs> life's been pretty okay. I, I just finished taking a an exam for history for college and uh i think i did really well on it at least the essay portion of it i guess it's cool to make a rap battle between spider-man and the imagine, like, Spider imagine liking history thora should i make a rap battle between spider-man and the itsy bitsy spider oh my god yes that'd be funny as hell it just make me this busy spider absolutely pop pop the fuck out. 
I already have. I, I wrote a Spider Man verse just for fun. And I'm gonna go, like, see how it sounds. I'm gonna be right back. What? Okay. O okay. So, guys, um. I don't know when. Actually, no. That's. That's. Ever, that, I'm pretty sure it's like a universal thing. But, um. Since Easter is coming up, uh, do you guys have any Easter stories you guys want to stay and share? Uh, I think I do. Uh, no. Is he, is, is he still like the, on the same day for the whole world, or is it different for some people? That's what I, th I said. I think it's like I think it's the same day for a majority of people. I don't know. So you can't think of a story? <laughs> no. Nope. Well, back whenever um, I was little, my grandparents owned like this uh, this type of like they have this land, and they uh, we would call it the river. It was just like, hey, you guys want to go uh, go to the river, and just do whatever. And this was like a place where we actually went and did like every holiday with each other like even if we were just like barbecuing or whatever like all of the all that's the one thing that i miss as a kid just like going to the river and just like being there with my dad's side of the family just hanging out and just literally, literally like we would be outside all day and like throw rocks and shit into the, the river even though that was illegal i think and see who, who and just ultimately like the game that we played was like the the you have to get like a big ass rock or whatever and you have to throw it into the river so and whoever has the biggest splash ultimately they had the biggest cock so oh. <laughs> oh, just a minute what? as soon as you heard that <laughs> what um <laughs> what <laughs> I, I, I was just kidding, obviously, but just, like, whoever had the biggest splash was, like, obviously, like, the coolest. Like, oh, my gosh, that was such a big splash. Holy shit. Tell your friends three inches is enough. It is enough. Don't, don't. The least of things I can remember is when we, when we'd go out hunting for eggs, we'd all just throw them, at, throw them at each other's heads. Don't say three inches isn't enough otherwise. Exactly. Otherwise what? A millimeter to fear. <laughs> But, uh, I don't know this, I don't even know if it was on Easter or not, but the thing about me was, like, I wanted to add, like, the biggest splash of the, of the century. So, I can find, I, I tried to find the biggest rock that I can find, and I would literally, like, scoop and, like, claw through, like, piles of dirt just to find rocks that were buried underneath the, the, the drive through or whatever that, that led up to the, to the land or whatever. So, I got this big ass boulder. It it, it, lo it looked like a boulder by the size of it. Like if like it was super hard to carry, and it was like it it f uh, filled up both of my hands. That's how big the rock was. And being young at the time, I was just like, holy shit, how am I gonna get this into the river? And I was thinking about it. I was like. I don't know if I should just throw the rock from all the way up top because the thing about it was, it's was, it was sort of like a cliff, a cliff that like goes down. So like, people who, whenever we were throwing the rocks, there is a it, it was like we're on the top of a cliff, and we had steps to go down to like the, the to the, like the little piece of land that was right below the river. So I don't know if you guys can picture that in your heads or not, but I just decided. You know, I think I'll be strong enough to just throw it into the river from all the way up here. And the thing was, I didn't know my brother was was down there. So, my brother, oh, was, shit. my brother was actually just. I think he was on the phone with somebody. It, I don't even know. I don't even know what he was doing down there. He was either on the phone with somebody or just doing something else. So he was down there, and I I had the rock, and I was just like, holy shit, this is heavy. I gotta let it go. So I throw the rock, and turns out like. The rock looks like it's barely about to hit the the water, just barely about to hit the water. And turns out I threw it in the direction of my brother. It hit the back of my brother's head and <laughs> He died. 
<laughs> no, no, he didn't die, but he j- he obviously like fell to his knees or whatever. I was like, oh shit! And at the time, like my brother would just like, you know, just beat me up because you know that's how brothers just play along, just like oh, you guys hitting each other. And I got so scared that I just ran away. I didn't know what to do. I just ran away. I locked myself in the bathroom of a trailer. And I did not come out of it for like hours. Like nobody knew I was in there. So I, I was just I just stayed in that bathroom and tried not to get beat up by my fucking brother. Cause whenever I saw whenever I threw it, it hit him. He went to his knees. He looked up for like where that was. I think he might have saw me. But uh yeah, it turns out uh I I get I got out of the bathroom later that day and I walked into the cabin, so he was in the cabin. And like I, he was actually bleeding from his head. Like it was, it wasn't like to the point where like his skull was like actually cracked or whatever. But like he was bleeding a lot, and I was like, oh shit, I I feel bad. But he didn't say anything to me afterwards, so I, I don't know what happened. Uh, that's all. That's just all I remember. Just throwing this big ass rock at my brother's head. Oh. Uh. I think I've said I, I I think I've told the story in some of my like earlier, like, story times, when that I made on my channel. But like, yeah. <clears throat> but going back to like to going back to like the Easter thing, I don't know how you guys would do it or how you guys would celebrate Easter, but we do like a an egg hunt. I don't know if you guys have ever contributed. Yeah, participate. Like egg hunts and just, and just eating chocolate eggs all day. That's basically it. Mm, but the thing with this egg hunt, like, um, I was a little monster whenever I was younger. So, like, if there was, like, money involved, I was just like, holy shit, I gotta get this money. I gotta get this bread. So, the the Easter egg hunt, there was, like, it was, throughout the whole entire land, they, they, they spread and they, and they hid Easter eggs. Not Easter eggs. Yeah, yeah, it was Easter egg. Why did I say it like that? But they spread it all across the, uh, the, the, the land or whatever. And I was so pissed off because I was like maybe like nine or ten while they were doing this. And so we actually lined up by age. So like the younger babies or whatever, they would go first and they would get all the eggs. I was just so pissed off because I wanted the eggs. So... So I had to wait until like the very end, and as soon as I, as soon as they said, "Okay, you guys go," I, I immediately just like took off because they said like the gold eggs had like quarters in them and and dollar bills in them. So I was just like, I I, I have to find these golden eggs, and the golden eggs were like way harder to find than any other egg. So I'm just like, they had they had to hide it somewhere. I literally I climbed trees, literally to see where it was. That that's how determined I was. And at most, I probably got like two dollars or three dollars in, in in quarters. So, yeah, it's a little fiend. Yeah. Uh, Ollie's gone. <clears throat> Ollie's been gone. Uh, it really? He, he's I was been, just looking at something else. He's been, he's been deafened this whole time. So, Ruben. Hi. Given your uh your heritage, have you ever done anything traditional for any holidays? Uh Yes, uh yes I have. All right, cool. Yes, I have. Is that okay? I don't know if you know this, but like what's that thing called where like you have to cut the bread, and then there's, like, a little figure in there. Uh, I don't remember the name, but, like, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. I uh, We do that you know? every year. And uh, I always get lucky. <laughs> I always yes, get sir. the figure. I always get the figure. Yeah. Of course, there's a... Hey, I have a question for you guys. Yeah. 
Did y'all do anything interesting okay. yesterday, like to your friends for April Fools? <laughs> not, not to my friends, but like, obviously, like I made the video or whatever. Wait, what no. video? I didn't see it. Oh, I made. Oh, all, all the. Uh, hold on, let me show you. Bard attack. No, 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 no. Keep forget, forgetting to make April Fool's plans. I have ideas in like October and then I forget about them. I wanted to get a rap battle out, but like I kind of forgot about it. <clears throat> so whenever I have, whenever I have April Fool's ideas, it's usually like a long time away from April Fool's, so I just end up forgetting. Mm, pal ratio, young boy, better. All right, Ollie. Uh, I'm gonna start sharing my screen. Damn. Damn! The second that I'm and I'm on a call, my friend finally wants to play Fortnite, bro. Oh, we're watching the realist rumble. Let's go. Oh my god! I saw this on your community post saying that you're actually gonna make a YBB. Are you actually? Yeah, I am. Kind of gay. Wow. All right. Okay. This is the first episode. Do you, are you watching right now? Yes. All right. Welcome everyone to the first episode of TRR, short for the realist. The one, the one YBB ref can't win because he's because he's not in it. I swear. I just thought it was finally time to give the people what they want. Uh, yeah. Crap. I need to think of shit to write down for this crap. Uh, uh okay. Hold on, uh, let me find something to write with. Don't even think about it, bitch! Holy shit, is that Big Boy Pen from HYB? Oh, wait. Gonna take a bigger shit and then I'll come on on your mama's tits. And whenever I did that, I think she had a fart attack. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> What's up, bro? Your mom's my chick. You know she be all on my dick. See, this is the heart attack remaster plus no one, no one knew about. You don't know how hard it was trying to take myself seriously recording this. You make me throw. If somebody heard you recording this, they were probably questioning everything. So I'm gonna take a big old shit and then I'll come on on your mama's tits. And whenever I did that, I think she had a fart attack. I think she had a fart attack. I think she had a fart attack. Spending hours all in her sheets She be processing my homie Can't no go in that room Cause the smell is so rank And if you try to sell me out Then I'll go outside and I'll shout Help this dude is no game Take a big old shit and then I'll come on when your mama stays And whenever I did that, I think she had a fart attack I think she had a fart attack I think she had a fart attack Many men, many, 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 many men I think she had a fart attack Many men, many, 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 many I think she's oh. the hey, can uh, one of y'all do me a favor? So I well, love start right that. now, and I I, I want to use this like premium filter, but I'm not paying for that, and it won't let me screenshot it. So can I share my screen, and then you guys just take a screenshot and send it to me? Uh, I'm on my computer right now. Hey, okay, so are you on your phone? Yeah. Alright, so I'm going to screen share it, and then I just need you to screenshot what I'm sharing and send it to me, okay? Okay. 
Sora, do you even have the screenshot ability to do that on your phone? I don't even know what phone you, you're using. I don't even know if you have an yeah. iPhone or not. I know, it's, I, know it's, I know it's an Android, but I have no idea what kind. Oh, man, I've been used to like iPhone for like so long. I couldn't do that shit. Did no, you thank record you. already? Uh, hold on. Uh, I'm only like 20 minutes into the recording. Mm. The stream. I didn't even get a chance to do anything. It ended. Mm. Alright, did you get it, Sora? <laughs> did you get it, Sora? No, it wouldn't load. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what? what are we guys no. doing? Oh, hap, hap, hap. It was just a pitch black screen the whole time. Okay, yeah, then, it, then they probably thought that. They probably thought around people trying to do that. Hap, hap, hap. Yes, yes, yes. I have to ask you a question. I asked everybody else's question that's joined, uh, even Ruben, but he already, oh, left. Yeah, that, he already left. Okay, so this is a pretty serious question, right? Mm hmm. Okay, if you had to fuck any flavor of Pop Tart, what would it be? What the fuck? That's <laughs> like what we all said. Blueberry? Who doesn't love sticking that dick in some cookies and cream? <laughs> uh, blueberry. blueberry. Oh, I said the same thing. Nice, nice. Ooh. Ooh. Did you just wake up? Yes, I just said that. What the fuck? It's almost like two. Like, why is this? What the fuck? I, I woke up at 8 o'clock and got four hours of sleep, Rev. What the hell? What were you doing all night? I couldn't yes. fucking sleep again. Have you tried running into the door at full at full speed? I, I, I think no, because that would wake everyone up, dumb fuck. But you'll be fast asleep, and they won't, and they won't and wake you up. You ever need to... You only need to wake yourself up, fill your sink with cold water, and fucking dunk your head in there. That works so well. Yeah. They always say, if it's under the sink, you take a drink. Okay. I don't know about that. But... I mean, you don't know about that. It's gonna work. Hap! Wait! Come on, buddy. It you gotta fix your sleep schedule. Motherfucker. <laughs> you say, you say like, I could easily do that. I... I yeah. Uh, I... Then just do it. Like the thing, the thing was with me. Like no matter how late I go to sleep, I'll always wake up in the morning. It's just I, I'm just a morning person. But I spend all my mornings in my bed until like eleven or twelve. And I just get up either way. Then you're not really. Pass I just pass out hour. for like an hour or two. You then you're not a morning person. You're just fucking lazy. Hey, what do you mean? I am a morning person. Debatable. I am a morning person. Just because I don't do anything in the morning doesn't mean that I'm getting, that I'm not a morning person. I'm I'm obviously waking up even without my alarm. I still wake up in the morning. Hey, real one, Rev. I don't know. I don't know how I manage to wake up sometimes. The fucking how fucking late I stay up. I literally okay, like. One, I literally like can't. I, I literally can't like wake up in the afternoon until. Uh, if I'm like, it's if if it's in the summer, then I'll probably wake up in the afternoon, because I had that happen a lot last year and like the year before that during the summer, where I would just wake up around like twelve or one, and then my my step. At least you never, well, never woke up at like fucking. At least you never woke up at like fucking four p.m. like I have before. Oh yeah, my my mom hates whenever we oversleep. She's like, come on, come on. I think because like. She doesn't want our days to be wasted, Mine can't I guess. complain about that shit. She oversleeps more than I do. <clears throat> what about you, Hab, Mr. <clears throat> Mr. Tired Man himself? Mr. Super Tired Man. What about I'm me? I'm talking about sleep, and, I, and I've been awake for several hours. Well, what, what is your sleep schedule like in the summer? Motherfucker, I will shit. go to sleep at 5 a.m. and wake up at 1 or 2 Interesting, interesting. Does your mom ever Does your mom ever get mad at you? Yeah. Damn. My fucking parents encourage shit like that. Thing is with my dad, my dad like he'll get mad at me because uh, he won't get mad at me about how late I oversleep, but like he'll get mad at me because like he'll go to work during like during the summer whenever I don't have school or whatever, I just stay inside. 
and I don't go anywhere. Like literally, like I can't. During this time, I was I think I was like 16. I can't drive. I can't walk anywhere to go do anything. So I just stay inside and just watch TV or YouTube or whatever, play video games. So my dad's like. Why are you still dressed like that? I'll still be in my like my pajamas and stuff, and I'll just be like, Dad, I don't, I don't go anywhere. Why do you expect me to dress up to for the day whenever I don't do anything during the day? He's just like, because you don't, you don't want to be in the same. He's like, you don't want to be in the same outfit every day. I was like, yeah, I'm obviously not in the same outfit. I'm wearing different pajamas every day, and, was, and this was the time where I didn't shower, so I was like, okay. Hey man, didn't you shower? Yeah, I said earlier whenever sore. Uh, I didn't. Uh, the longest I haven't taken a shower was like a whole week. Like, what the That's fuck so is long wrong with you, uh, dude? Like I said, man. Like it was a summer. I did whatever I want. Stayed inside all day. Fuck off. I stayed inside I all want... day. Just didn't do anything, man. I once, I, I once uh, didn't take a shower for a whole month. No, you didn't. <laughs> what the fuck? That's, that's a lie. You're you're lying. You're capping. I'm not lying. That oh sounds... my god, I was like, I was like yeah, four bro. years old. Four years. Oh my god, that doesn't fucking count. Oh. If you're a baby, was... then that's understandable. But like, and once I once stood, stood up till six in the morning when I was really little. But like, I don't know if I went to bed or if I just stood up. What was the latest y'all ever stayed up? I, uh, I'm pretty sure all of us. Well, are... we're going to sleep or do all nighters count? Seven. All all nighters, I'm pretty sure count. But... Well, all nighters, but like you obviously had to go to sleep after all that. All so... nighters count, and the longest I've stayed up is like forty hours. God damn! Whole two days. No sleep. Almost two. Almost two days. What the you fuck, didn't last... man? Fuck is strawberry milkshake. Oh. <laughs> That's what I said. Oh, I didn't die. I don't know. Don't taste them. Like, th like I, I only found those at like fucking Dollar Tree. Like they're not in like Walmart or anything. And I can Dollar see why. Dollar Tree. I can see why they're not at fucking Walmart or any other like place like Kroger or any place else. The Grubhub ad. I don't even know what half these places are. Keep my wife's name. Do you know what Food sure. Lion is? Yeah, no. I always go there. That sounds like a, a hotline for food. <laughs> no. Food line. It's, a... it's, it's not food line, it's food lion. Food. <laughs> oh, I thought no, you said food you line. Dumb ass. You go <laughs> it's a store. It's like a grocery store. I don't have one here, but I have I, I, I don't I don't, I don't know what have one. That, that I explains why I've never heard of it. <laughs> the weird thing is like the this like the grocery store that's in my city you will never find it anywhere else <laughs> like, yeah. li like mm -hmm. I, I i don't know if you guys have heard of it but it's literally called heb just nope and Wait, heb yes heb oh yeah, yeah, yeah and they're only it's only named like that because all throughout my state like there's hebs like in like rural areas yeah. not like in urban areas but my 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 city yeah, is like my city is like sort of urban urban but like there are some parts of it that may be like rural or whatever but i don't uh, live i don't even live in a city you don't you don't live in a city no is it like a town or like a county or like what is it a town oh okay basically that makes sense but the only reason basically why... two shitty one down towns joined together. <laughs> the only reason why it's called H E B is because it's named after like this one dude that um uh, that was in this city and became like a historical figure or whatever. And his name was literally was just, it was like an hour away. His his name H E B was like an acronym for his actual name. His name was Henry E. Butt. Like his last name was Butt. <laughs> Butt. But, Boy. but the thing was on my, on my fucking college I literally had a teacher whose last name was Bud Professor Bud 
Boy. Hello, class. I am professor, but I will be a professor this semester. Boy. 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 I think his name was probably the, the weirdest ass name I've ever heard of. I heard a teacher have. Holy shit. What was your favorite year of school? Oof. I actually don't know, because I don't like school. I did my what? sixth grade. 2015. Okay, my... it's a tie between my fourth grade year and my sixth grade year. What was so good about it? Well, 2015 was definitely year... the best. Well, my fourth grade year was my last year in New York, so I obviously have memories there. But it's also, like, the most fun I've had with my my childhood friends for, like, a long time before I moved. Mm-hmm. And then sixth grade was just overall great. That's awesome. What about you guys? I don't know. 2015 is like the only, you, you, only you year said, I can rem- remember in talk- school. You were talking about someone named Butt, right? <laughs> Yes, we were talking about that, but like, but, but like, in school, what was your favorite year that you had, like, in in a grade? I have no idea. Have y'all ever accidentally gone viral on TikTok? Yes. I forgot the neighbors' names in Sanjay and Craig were called the Dixons. <laughs> Okay, and why is that relevant? Dude, no, I was trying no. to I was trying to look for Sanjay and Craig butt jokes to make on the fucking podcast, but because I know oh, you like Sanjay and Craig have. for some weird reason. Literally, there's there's a kid there's a kid in my math class, and his last name is literally Gay. <laughs> it's just Gay. His last name is Gay, and people made fun is of him. So is, it spelled, is it spelled differently? No, literally Gay. <laughs> It's spelled G A Y. It's just gay. Yeah, and then and then freaking and then uh he's getting it legally. This is the last you heard of Mr. Gaylor Robinson. <laughs> and we miss the gay Mr. Gay go stand in the corner. <laughs> Mr. Gay go stand in <laughs> Mr. Gay go wait in the closet. <laughs> I'm homophobic. <laughs> uh, Mr. Gay. Mr. Gay. Mr. Gay, it's time to come out. Dude, dude. <laughs> I forgot. Out I forgot. I literally had a. <laughs> I literally had a teacher who got fired because they put a kid in the closet. What the fuck? I literally, I literally had a fucking head teacher who did that. The fucking principal, the whole oh, school. You, did I ever tell you guys about how I had a racist substitute? Oh, were okay, they homophobic? So what happened? Okay, so wait, this is what happened. Okay, but were they homophobic? Yeah, so. Okay, so what happened was, uh, my my <laughs> science teacher, she had jury duty, right? So she would be gone for three days, and each of the three days we had a different substitute. And on the second day, we had this substitute who, um, one of her eyes, like, l- like, was like looking the other way. So she had like a but, lazy eye. But like she was eye. staring like at you, yeah. I, I have a friend who. Did you cross eyes or something? And and basically, uh, <clears throat> for the first half of class, we were doing our uh, work, but we were also talking, and understandably, she was like. All right, that's it. Rest of you guys go to your seats. And okay, that's understandable. But what I don't get, she threatened to suspend us if we said if we uh talked more than three times. Like she said, three strikes and you're out, right? What the? So throughout the class, so throughout the next the next like twenty minutes of class, it's like dead silent. She's giving out uh strikes for BS reasons. Like a kid literally fucking coughed, and she said strike one, and then he's like, "What do I do? That's strike two. Talk again, you get suspended." Oh, and then. Other kids are like, you can't do that. That's strike one. That's strike one. And she was, and she was basically bitching the whole time. So then, five minutes, dead silent. And then, out of nowhere, I just hear a ban. A what? What? Ban. 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 That's ban. Ban. And I'll tell you, hearing that sound in the dead silent with the racist substitute. Was the funniest shit ever. I 
died laughing. The whole class died laughing. And she only picked out the black kids and only picked on the black kids for the next two periods. She um she even gave one of the black kids detention because I guess she realized she couldn't give them suspension. And the rest of the class and the rest and the rest of the classes like told us about how they were she was only picking on the black kids. So a bunch of black kids went up to the principal and reported her and she got banned from ever subbing in the school district again. Damn. I want to let you know, Ollie. Like whenever he, whenever you kept on saying "black kids," <laughs> I turned on his camera and he smiled with a thumbs up. I know, I saw. <laughs> Have that sad face you were making reminded me of just you, just like your face with the caption just saying "no bitches." <laughs> just that sad face. <laughs> You'd be like, yeah, "no bitches." <laughs> That's <laughs> no, 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 nuggets, no nuggets, no nuggets. <laughs> I'm turning this, turn this camera on and turns around, man. <laughs> no nuggets. But like I was no saying, no okay, bitches. this is gonna be a little racist, but um, uh, I'm black. No, not not to you, not to you, but oh, okay. Okay. but uh, we have uh, so our our no hamster. <laughs> for sixth grade yeah, was it fifth grade oh no it was sixth grade yeah for sixth grade we had this teacher miss pena and uh she sounded like she was like she just got here if you know what i mean so she was like a little she was like a little asian teacher like a very uh, oh asian teacher and she pronounced everything like wrong like my friend jesus she she called him jay's ass that just jay's ass <laughs> I know it's it sounds racist, but just bear yeah, with yeah, me, all right, all right. Jay's ass. Jay's ass. <laughs> uh, she, she called my friend. Jay's ass. She called my friend Jesse the same thing. It's like Jesse, Jay's ass. Like she was so hard to pronounce the names. And my friend Adrian, uh, she, he was just messing around. He like talks a lot with my friends and stuff. Just not really paying attention. I was like, you know, that's that's cool. Don't, I don't mind him. And so she she. She told him several times to just quiet and just be quiet, and he did. And then he ended up talking again. And then she said, "You know, that's it." She took a chair. Well, she stopped teaching. She took a chair. She put it in the in the closet that they had there. And then she's like, "Get in, get in." And I was just like, "What yeah. the fuck?" And so my friend oh, no. Agent was just like laughing, but then he was also like kind of confused he wasn't scared or anything but he just like had like a confused look on his face and she said uh, she wasn't gonna start the next lesson because she was like a math teacher she said i'm not gonna start the next lesson until you get in there and so he went in there and he stayed in there the entire class period <laughs> until the bell rang and so they reported her and then she got fired <laughs> and we didn't have a, we didn't have an actual math teacher until the end of the the school year because this was like at the beginning of the first semester Wait, so she was like the brand new math teacher? She was the brand new math teacher and then like the the su <laughs> like the substitute math teacher was just uh another dude who was or who is the science teacher, but literally he did not give a shit about us. And there was so what did y'all learn? Nothing. Literally nothing. He just wrote on the board. He's like, "All right, you guys should be able to figure this out. Um, just just do the lessons like you're assigned to." And like there were times on the computer where I, we would look where he's like what he's doing and he's playing fucking minecraft on the computer <laughs> and he no he, man and he did that like a couple of times but still like he, he didn't give a shit about us the rest of that fucking school year once my friend got in school suspension because so my friend is a kid who likes to wear his hoodie a lot right but of course schools have a no hoodie rule that's but stupid. he never like listens to it. Like he always wears his hoodie, and he always gets told, "Don't wear your hoodie. Don't wear your hoodie. Don't wear your hoodie." And he never listens. And you so know, one day, I never got understood that. I never understood that rule. What's because, wrong with wearing your hoodie in class? Well, the rule the rule is for like if if like um uh, if everyone was wearing their hoodie and they in an emergency they needed to uh identify people if they have their hoodie on they can't see who it is. See, my school had something similar to that. Like, um, like we can wear like hoodies and stuff, but like we can't wear the hood of the actual hoodie. We can't wear that indoors. But yeah, like, that's what I meant. Like the oh, hood. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, but that's so stupid. Though. But like as I was saying, like he he would never listen, 
Well, he kept wearing his hood, and eventually, uh, he was walking on his way to PE class, and this teacher, this, like, military sergeant, uh, teacher, came up to him, and was like, hey, I need to take your hoodie off for me. And instead of taking his hoodie off, this nigga ran! <laughs> he ran! Okay, why'd you- okay. He ran? He just ran away from him! And, he was and, you just, <laughs> and they reminded me of that scene from Cloudy and Enchanted Meatballs where that cop was chasing him! He was running oh away! God. And oh, it was so- it was movie? so funny! And eventually- Excuse me? What? <laughs> Go on, Ollie. And eventually- and eventually they started arguing, and- <laughs> And after a while, you just hear from downstairs at the gym, you just hear, I don't like you, please fuck off! And, um... <laughs> and he got in-school suspension, and the worst part is, he was already grounded, and he got- and he got an extended ground- and he got grounded for another month because of that. Oh, your school be wildin' in, Jesus Christ. Yeah, I, I yelled at my math teacher, and he gave me candy. Hello? <laughs> But anyway, Hap, what were you saying about that beautiful movie? What? It's not yeah, good. Was... What do you mean it's not good? It's not, not good. good. He's talking about Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. It's not a good movie. Wait, who I'm... made that movie? The good? first or the second oh, one? God. Both. What do you mean? Neither... I don't like either of them. They're both what bad. Studio it? it was it DreamWorks? Sony, no, picture of animation. Okay, okay. Doesn't like it. it was Sony. What'd you say, Sora? Every time, why is it like whenever we talk about movies, you like you don't like any of them? You little bitch about movies. What do you mean? Like I'm okay. You act like I hate every movie you guys watch. I don't. You. You do. Yeah, that's what you sound like. Anyway, no, you don't. Uh, you don't. Exactly. Not, Look, not every, not every movie, movie, but I. I don't. Like, I. Okay. I never liked it. We were watching it in fucking. I remember we watched that like at the end of school in uh, fucking. Uh, what is it? I believe it was fourth, gr third grade, third grade. We were watching in third grade. I got so fucking bored of that shit. I don't think I've I, ever seen the second one. Actually, don't watch the second, the second one's one. not any better. Don't watch actually, the second one. Was... Okay, the second one shit. What is yes. your okay? What is your guys's favorite Pixar movie? We already answered this several times. Well, I don't know. So like, uh, what is, what is, you, you, uh, we have on the podcast and in the chat, we've said me and Haps is uh, Coco, and then. Well, I forgot it. Now right. say it again. I just said it. Me and Haps is Coco, and Sora's is like fucking uh, Wally or Ratatouille or some shit. Oh, it's Coco. I don't... Yeah. Coco's Coco's good, but Encanto. like. Encanto isn't Pixar. I know. Encanto is also not good. It's not. Encanto's good, but Thank Coco's you. better. Encanto's really See, good. Na, na, that, 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 now me and Sora can agree on that. Okay, my favorite Pixar movie is Inside, Inside Out. Out yeah. no, no, Inside, Inside, Inside Out. Inside Out. Like. Inside Out's a good one, but like, it, it, it's a little forgettable to me. It's uh. Teenager no, look, it's and, my... and the vibes. Look, no, the thing is, it's it's my favorite. It's my favorite, but it's not the best. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. it, I, I, I don't think it's like. Uh, turning mid is mid. I don't like turning I don't, red. I, I don't. I don't hate cars one and three. Kill me if you want. I don't hate no, cars, cars two. Cars, cars one was ass. Cars two was even worse, and cars three is decent. What? Cars one is not ass. What the fuck? I'm yes, the only, why am I the only one in the fucking world who likes all three of the movies? Because, because you're, you're super happy. Stupid! stupid. Cause, the fucking, Cause the fucking second one is genuine ass I won't defend. Yes, the second one is very bad. I am like the only one who actually likes the second one. Unironically. Let, 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 let me get this straight. You like all Cars movies yet hate the Shrek movies. Yes. Why? Because they're entertaining. Because they're because they're actually entertaining. Terrible. All right, sorry. Uh, sorry. The, 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 the cars, the cars movies are actually entertaining. Okay. okay. No, they're ass. Yeah, I can agree with I can agree with two of two of them being entertaining. 
Cars two is that. entertaining. How even is it entertaining? Even if it's bad, Cars two I want to make fun of. Cars two is like shot. I mean, I want to make fun of it. Even if you think it's bad, it's badly entertaining. Jesus. Look, look, so I'm going to stand by this once and for all. Cars one is bad. Cars two is bad. Cars three is decent. It's great. No, it's not bad when you want to I, I, would, me I would say that Cars 3 is is the best out of the three. I would say it that. is! But it is! The first one is actually I think the first one is the best. Okay, that's understandable yeah. too. But me as me and Sora as as I don't know if me and Sora can agree that the I don't know if me and Sora can agree that the second one's the best. Not the second one, the first one's the best. Yeah, I just said the first one's the best. Okay, me and Sora agree that the first one's the best. Like and it's that's very steep competition because I like well, almost, it's, it's, if the second one, like, I'm not this. I can't even. I can't even watch the second one to make fun of it. It's not a fucking movie like Shark Tale, or I can just watch it to take the piss out of it. <laughs> like, that's. Really, I just think that's, it's fucking. I, I can't fun. get that with that movie. All right. I like the world building in Cars too. I think it's fucking fun. The, the world building. You mean just going to different locations and racing? <laughs> yes. Listen. 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 Yeah. But there's movies. That take place in only one fucking location. Ref, you watch a whole anime that takes place in one fucking location, all right? I did. That's Re Zero Season. Wait, hold on. Exactly. Re Zero Season 2 takes place in one. Question. Yes. Did Cheese get hacked? That's not relevant. All right, what are you saying? Wait, no. No, I'm <laughs> no we just made you a I don't no, think I'm she. Serious. Did he get hacked? I don't fucking what know. Makes you, what makes you think she's got, got hacked? Man, when okay. did I ask? No, no, I'm yeah, serious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, right, 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 I'm serious. Right, 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 right. He, made, he made so many community posts yesterday, and then his community post today said, I'm finally back now. What did I miss? He's probably he made he probably uh, made those for April oh, Fools. Okay, okay, yeah, exactly. I was gonna say, Ollie, you realized so yesterday was April Fools, right? Yes. I'm a DM I'm and like, Hydra even said that she was gonna go back to the fucking OSC. Like, who? who, who you else? really believed all that? I was, gonna, I was gonna make a video. Not I was me. Gonna make a video. Not me. I was gonna make a video saying I'm joining the SCPB community. Oh my god, really? Did anyone even fall for any of our tricks? No. Well, I guess. For my Hydro video, fell, someone did. Hydro fell for one of my tricks. Oh yeah, with me and Hap switching names. Yeah, <laughs> that was funny. But, it was funny. Yeah. I, I didn't. I, I didn't fall for that because the moment I saw Hap was in the HYB server, I fucking knew something was up. Okay. 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 I just... No, I really don't think. He, no, the thing is, I really don't think Cheese would make a post saying "gay, gay, lesbian." Right. I gotta switch. Okay, I gotta that's switch names with someone. That's a yeah. prank, Ollie. Yes. No, nah, but he get he'd actually get in trouble with his parents if he made a post like that. His parents know that he has YouTube. Yes. Okay. What a pussy. Anyway. Imagine your parents knowing and imagine keeping it my secret. Parents, from no, my mom. My mom knows years. I have YouTube, but she does not give a fuck what I do on there. As long oh, as same. I don't do any shit like illegal or anything. Same. My, my mother does not know I have YouTube, and she. My mom knows I have a fucking YouTube. girlfriend. So, <clears throat> literally, yeah. I've shown I my think, mom a few episodes good. of the shit cast. My mom likes the shit cast. I show my mom a few episodes of fictional beatbox fight out. She likes fictional beatbox fight yeah, but I would never show any of my parents like any fucking YVB shit or anything like that. N never. Oh, I'm not showing her any YVB oh, shit. Oh, yeah, because... yeah, yeah, same, same. Well, actually, I showed her like maybe like two. And that's it. And that's only because I don't do that many YVBs. But anyway, uh, like I was going to say, Hap. Yeah, I like how you say you don't so do you many like... YVBs yet. I'm over here with Most, only two the, battles. The popular ones I mean are the ones I don't yeah, like. So I, don't saying, I don't think like six is a lot. I don't know about that. Anyways, go on with what you were saying, bitch. Uh, ha. So you really <laughs> like... So I'm just... I'm just I, let me get this theory, Ed. You like a movie where Mater... Mater is the main protagonist. And he's supposed to be... Yes. And he's supposed to be the hero. Mater, Mater! The, 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 I, the stupid hero that, that saves us all. And yet, you also yeah. like Lightning being an absolute dick to him. Lightning is not that. You look, dude, you look the lightning is not that show, much eh? of a dick. He says one fucking thing. 
Guy, you don't even remember that Lightning is kind of a dick to literally everyone in the first movie. Uh, yeah, he but is. then he humbles himself. You have a lot of you have yeah, a lot of that, that's, no, like, that's, that's literally what he does. That's literally what he does in the second movie. He humbles himself no, and realizes honest, what he did was wrong. I, don't think he, I forget he's even in the second movie. He's all barely right, fucking right, in right. it. Exactly. You, you take the main okay. character out of the, 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 the Cars movie. Okay, okay, and okay. And replace it with I, Mater. And then I this fucking, you... this fucking the baby car and then the sexy ass fucking spy bitch. Yeah, yeah. Okay, oh, okay. Let me pause you right there. <laughs> Baby Are you car. fucking turned on by a fucking vehicle? Yes, I want to stick yes. my dick in the engine. <laughs> you, you have problems. You get turned on by literally anything. Hydro, wait. What did you say? What did you say in general? What did you say? Oh. All right, all right. Let's let's okay, what's the best DreamWorks movie? What? Anyways, no, no, I'm not done with this discussion yet. I am not done with this. Oh my god, here we go. He's defending cars. Here we go. That's a juice sound. He's defending cars too. Hold on, let me hear what he's got to say. Yeah, I know how I sound like. Anyways, listen, I know for, I know for a fact that y'all would not hate cars two as much if it was not called cars two. What do you mean? What else would they fucking call it? No, I don't know. Call fucking... Cars, cars, a new legacy. They can call. They can call it fucking Car Spies featuring Mater. Nobody wants and to I see a. Hate it. Nobody wants to see a fucking Landing, spy uh, movie with the, cars. Tell us what we're gonna call it. Driving fucking land vehicles to the second. What the fuck? <laughs> land vehicles to the second. Listen, I'm not saying Cars Two is a fucking masterpiece by any means. Hell no. I think it. I think it's the worst of the Cars movies for fuck's sake. But I just think I I like it. I think it's fun. I think it's entertaining. I like the first, I like the first one and second one the most. First I like one and third one. It's, can a, be used it's, as mater, it's mater. supposed to be emotional, but it's a fucking mater of all people. Like it's mater. not supposed to be emotional, right? It's supposed to be fucking. <laughs> yes, it was the the, the, no, the confession it's where really mater. Not. No, the confession where mater is like, I'm not a spy. I'm not a spy, and then he just fucking. It's supposed to be sad. Like what the fuck? Nobody cares. I'm a that, that's a bitch. And then the emotional part where Lightning yells at him, and he goes, Yee! and then just whines and fu fucking goes away. Just, God, it's, why are you taking cars so seriously? Why are you taking cars so seriously? I'm not. <laughs> it's just the emotional parts with <laughs> Mater. <laughs> the, the emotional parts with Mater in them just are not compelling. I'm sorry. The emotional parts with like oh, with Lightning and Doc and everything else, that's fine. I like those. Because they chose to make emotional parts with Mater of all characters. He's supposed to be the you comic need to relief. Shut the up and watch out, though. Yeah, that's why I like the movie. Oh, my God. All right, happy. you like the movie. That's good for you, buddy. Thank you. Yeah, I, love, I, love, I love the part when Mater lies about killing the shark. Ah! Cars 3 better be the last Dan Cars movie. I swear to God, if they make another one. Please make Cars 4. Why? I swear to God. I swear to God, <laughs> it, if they make another one, one, I will. Please make Cars 4 just to piss off Ollie. <laughs> You know what? If they make, if they announce or slash make Cars two, uh, Cars four in the next two years, I will buy a maid dress and dance to it and dance in it. Okay. Nice. Good for you. Buddy. Then they just, then they just then they just announce it as the next movie. Anyways, my favorite DreamWorks movie is Home. What the fuck? Okay. Oh, Home is ass. Okay, can, I, can, I say, can I say something about Home? What? There's one reason I I like Home, and I think you know why. Rihanna. No, no, Jim Parsons. Jim Wait, Rihanna oh. is at home? Jim Parsons. Oh, Jim Parsons oh my is god. Fucking, Rihanna is yeah. fucking tip. Oh, Jim Parsons oh wait, she, I didn't even. Yeah, I only recently got into oh, Rihanna, alright? <laughs> Rihanna yeah, is the Rihanna fucking girl. And then her oh, mom. Okay. And then her yeah, mom okay. is J-Lo. Look, look. Fucking, no, look, Liz, I, I, look, I grew listen. up. I didn't realize I grew up with Rihanna, if I'm being honest with you. Like, fucking, there's a lot of songs I just listened to, like fucking Rude Boy and Only Girl in the World. I didn't realize Rihanna sang those songs when I was fucking, like, four or six or some shit. Yeah, she also sang work, work. No, like, the thing is, like, the thing is, I, I grew up on home, okay? I, I watched that movie a lot. But even I can say, like, I rewatched it. It is ass, bro. It is I'm so not saying ass. It's, I'm not saying it's ass, but I'm just saying it's not that good of a movie. 
I just I don't really no. like the comics. best. Okay, the best. Okay, hear me out. The best um Dreamers movie is Shrek Forever After. Really, that Anyways. is a that yeah. is a very hot take. I like I like that movie too, but I don't think it's the best. I I just well, what is the best? Fucking Trolls World Tour. Yes. Hell no. <laughs> I'm kidding. What? But Good. okay, uh, okay, trolls kidding. gets a lot of hate. I actually, I I do like trolls. All right, there's. No, I don't, uh, if you rewatch, you those know what? Movies, I'm not gonna fuck fucking hate on you for because I like cars too. No, if you if you rewatch Trolls one, you could see how much dirty jokes are in there. Exactly, which makes it fun. Like I, like the cloud dude. One of his lines is "Give me a slappy to make daddy happy." Yes. Are you still talking about home? No, we're talking about no. fucking trolls. <laughs> Sora, Sora. I don't know. I don't know can, I Sora, can you and me both agree that when we watch trolls, we would just want to burn the whole fucking world? Jesus, that's... Basically, the only thing I wanted to burn was my eyeballs. Your balls? My, my eyeballs. eyeballs. Oh. <laughs> it's not his balls. God damn, God damn you need to get laid. Wow. Oh, Fuck off! In all, in, in all seriousness, my, my my favorite movie is probably Kung Fu Panda Two or um, either Kung Fu Panda Kung Two, Fu Mega, Panda. Kung Fu Panda Two, Mega Mind Two, not Mega Mind Two, Mega Mind or uh, Mag, uh, Madagascar Two. What about Madagascar? Right, no, no. Three DreamWorks trilogies: How to Train Your Dragon, Madagascar, and Kung Fu Panda. Which is the best? Madagascar. Kung actually, no, I'll no, actually, dragon. no, Kung Fu Panda. I um, I want to I want to say Kung Fu Panda, I but Dragon. I want to say Kung I'll Fu Panda. Train Your Dragon or Kung Fu Panda. The second one sucks. I want to say Kung Fu Panda, but the second one sucks. I, I just get more enjoyment from Madagascar. Also, I don't like tra How to Train Your Dragon at all. I can see why you don't, but I'm just saying the second one sucks. I don't like that. The third one's okay. I don't really like any of the movies, to be honest. <clears throat> because I think, when the sun like, I think like Kung Fu Panda is like Panda the only like trilogy the that's movie. like, like really great. Like the Kung Fu Panda. Madagascar. That that like no, there there are some Madagascar movies that are kind of like eh, but like every single Kung Fu Panda movie is great. I just I like Madagascar after the Will Smith and Chris Rock thing because it's funny as fuck. <laughs> I just I like. I think Madagascar no, is just mean, the most solid and the Madagascar best. Madagascar and Tail memes, and they're the funniest thing I've ever seen. What is your? Keep my wife's name. What's the? What, what's the? What, what do you think about Madagascar three app? What do you think about Madagascar three? It's the worst, but it's not bad, like at all. Okay, including the Madagascar movies, I guess it's. What do you think about the penguins movie? Oh, I like it. It's actually, I actually like, I really like it. I like, the, I'm, a, I'm gonna be honest. I like the Penguins movie over every Madagascar movie. Oh yeah, uh, yeah, same. I agree. I agree. Okay, okay. I don't know why. Though. I just, I just the like penguins the Penguins. Are still a lot more enjoyable. All right, all right, hear me out. Hear I, me out. Despicable Me Two is better than both other ones. What the yes. fuck? Agreed. I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. I think the Despicable Me Two is the best Despicable Me movie. Actually, no, it was an actually good movie, like objectively. Chuck Taylor was a funny no, movie. No, I, I, oh, yeah, I'm saying I agree with you. Yeah, yeah, I know. Why is it? What is what is that well, one movie like, you will always watch to, I also, to make? Like, I also like Minions. Minions is actually fine. I. I used to, dude, okay, kind of like was you on this home. I grew up on Minions, and I could say I rewatched it. I fucking hate it. I'm not gonna. No, I just no. I I don't like the minions in general. I think they're really annoying. Okay. Remember, I would grow. I would always grow up with these. What was that voice crack? Jesus, sir, that was a <laughs> the fucking yeah. voice crack. I the fuck up. <laughs> if you could yeah. fuck okay. any cartoon character, who would it be? I'm Gloria not the Hippo. That question. <laughs> Rev. Are, Gloria the Are you fucking serious, Rev? <laughs> no, obviously uh, not. Okay. Keep my he wife's name. Fuck this voice. Be kind. 
when the sunshine won't shine together. Told you I'd be here forever. What the fuck is this? Okay. What the fuck is this? Oh, okay. Never mind. I thought I saw something else. Was... Zerb has probably been recording for like only two minutes and we wouldn't even been knowing it. You never know. No, I doubt. He, he probably started recording on like half joined. Anyways. Uh. Oh. Uh, I, have, I have a really good question for everyone. What's up? What's. Okay. Did. Have any, any of you care guys ever wanted two characters to get together so bad? Like, yes. 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 Out of the two care, out of what are those two characters? Dora and Boots. <laughs> I'm going to kill you. <laughs> I'm kidding. What is fucking wrong with you? <sighs> the only time I've actually I've actually wanted that to happen during a show that's that's pretty much what the season two finale was. So, yeah. So you're saying from like anything, like any cartoon or anything? Any cartoon, game, movie, <clears throat> anything. Okay, hold on. I gotta think about this. I I really have to think about this. Um, Verbalization, Patrick. What the fuck okay. is wrong with you? Rev, <laughs> you literally wanted a fucking child to get to get with a monkey. All right. I said I that as a joke. I said I did that. Yeah, joke. Ollie also said no, that. No, no. Okay, no. Okay, okay. Okay. Black Widow and Hawkeye. Oh, okay. What's your, okay, that's cool. What's your what? Yeah, the, 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 the two Mar- uh, they're two Marvel characters, don't worry. It, I, I can see why. This but, time, it feels obvious. I, I like that dynamic. They they have a really good friendship. And that one scene yeah. where Black Widow dies, I, I was kind of tearing up a bit. Obvious answer, I, okay. I cried when Black Widow died, but not when Iron Man died. Wow, that's that, you're fucked. I didn't cry when Iron Man died. And I didn't cry when Aunt May died. Yeah, that's true. Can I say? No, can, I, oh my God, can I say that, dude? I remember I watched the live action Lion King with my mom and my sister, and oh dude, dude, the the moment where I said, "But wait," I was fucking, I was, I was holding myself from trying to laugh at that shit. Because, <laughs> it was then, so funny. And, 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 and then my mom and my sister were just looking at me, smiling, and they're like, "You're awful." I. I, I... And I'm over here like, okay, why don't I laugh at the animated version, but I laugh at the live action version? Oh, yeah, because the live action version fucking sucks. For a minute, I thought he said the I thought he said the animated version sucked. For a minute, I was about to pop the fuck up. Hell no! I was, dude, dude, I was so embarrassed because I actually went to go watch it in theaters, and my mom and my sister were the only ones who were fucking laughing. (laughs) At the fucking jokes in it, I was just like, <laughs> "Well, the pe- other people were laughing, but my mom and my sister were like the loudest. Like you can obviously tell it's them." And I was just like, "Okay, I did not laugh once in that whole entire fucking." Movie. You should have. You should have sat with another people. Other people just fit in. <laughs> Some of my fucking family actually prefers the live action versions, and I'm like, "What the what fuck? What the fuck is wrong with him?" Okay. It's kind of oh. gay. Yeah, my 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 mom, my sister, they like they they saw like the scene of Simba. They thought that was so cute, but then they saw me laughing. They're like, "You're they horrible." They didn't prefer the live action Aladdin because I would have killed them. And then my and then my sister and then I had a conversation with my sister the other day, and I was like, "Penis." I, Penis. No. Penis. I, I, I said Penis. fucking. Shut up. Penis. Yeah, I was talking to my sister the di- um a few days after we were watching the movie, and I said that movie fucking sucked. Penis. Oh, oh, I gotta th- ah, fuck. I can't. I can't think of any uh, anything, bro. I can't think of. Oh my. Okay, I, I actually have an answer to that question that I was referring to myself. Actually, funny enough. What yeah, is what's it? up? It was, it was a few. Actually, there's like, there's two, but one of them is really unrealistic, but I think it's really cute nonetheless. And the other one, I, I'm like, they, they should have fucking made it official. Mm-hmm. I think Sora can agree with me on at least one of these, if not both Just of them. Just say it! Just say it! Shut up! Well, Anyways. My, 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 my answer was obvious, so that's why I posted it. <laughs> Anyways, uh, for one, uh, Sonic and Sonic and Amy. What the? Okay. 
Okay. I like that. Look, they're. I think they would be cute together, honestly. But I like. Are they not official? I don't think so. No. Wait, what? No, they're not official. I thought they were. Closest of ever. Closest of ever came to that is a few. No, Sonic and Sonic and Amy. They're like. No, he he's always running away from her. What yeah, are you talking about? Obviously has a crush on them. It's like it's like extremely inconsistent. So in some yeah, TV shows, like, he acts like they likes her back, and some he doesn't. No, like, didn't like Amy like help him escape from jail, and he just ran away. Yeah, <laughs> you think Sonic gives a fuck? And then he like kind of fucked the human for class. Oh no, wait, no, Sonic died! <laughs> Sonic died and the human princess gave him a kiss! I, li I like how she has, like, absolutely no fucking reaction what whatsoever. Okay, I think I, think I got it. I'm gonna put, gonna put princesses like in another castle it. bullshit. This isn't Super Mario Brothers. Wait, what were you saying, Rev? <clears throat> the only thing that comes to mind I wish, like, they'd be together is, like, okay, you're probably gonna hate me for this, but, like, if you, if you watch Teen Titans, like, you, Robin and Starfire... I, I think they'd be pretty cool. Like Robin, oh yeah, yeah. I, I'm I'm talking about OG. Like I'm talking about OG. Yeah. Teen Titans Go. Yeah, like OG, they definitely. just they just treat like the relationship like it's shit in Teen Titans Go. I'm just like, come on, bro. Robin, he's a good dude. Why are you trying? Why is he trying you so actually hard? Sat Teen Titans Go. Surprisingly, the original series. Teen Titans Go is not a bad show. show. It's not a bad show. But I'm talking. But the OG, the, like in the finale, they finally get together. But like everything else, yeah. like the OG I, is better though. Like come on. No thing. shit, the OG's better, but still. But like throughout the whole series, like I guess like the tension between them was pretty high. So I was just like, "Come on, man, just get together." So I, I, I mean, in the end, they did, but like it's whatever, I guess. Yeah. Uh, I'm probably one of the only ones who watched that show. Uh, what is it? Okay, and the other one I was talking about, the main one I was talking about. Uh, so my this is the one I feel like Sora could agree with me on this because I think. Have you watched the X Y anime? Yeah, yes, I have. Okay, oh, so know. Ash and Serena. Bro, for real! For real! Yeah, for, for real. Bitch literally uh, kissed uh, him on the final on the final scene we saw yeah, her. Ash, Ash probably got hard from that. <laughs> no, he, he, no, he just had like, oh, what is this? What's uh, happening? I'm, no. What well, wasn't his fucking reply like? Oh, oh, what's happening? Oh, that you see a guy in fucking Carlos or some shit like that. <laughs> Pikachu, what's going on? In my pants. Uh oh, <laughs> Pikachu! Oh, I didn't know I had a metapod in my pants. What the? <laughs> <laughs> what's happening to my Poke Pearls? <laughs> uh oh, did I catch you all? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh boy, my full torps are flying. <laughs> oh, oh no, I thought I'd seen it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Does this mean I'm pregnant? What? He's a boy. STD. What kind of Pokemon? I gotta that? catch all. I gotta catch it all. Except an STD. Which Pokemon would you? Fuck? No. Did you say which Pokemon I, would I fuck? No. Uh, no, I didn't say that. Are you sure? Green Goblin. Uh, what the? No. Sora, I want to ask you. Sora, I want to ask you a very important question. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think? What do you think? What is up with your voice cracking? <laughs> anyways. <laughs> anyways. Yeah. Anyways. What do you think is the best and the worst Sonic cartoon? Oh. <coughs> best is. Well, after rewatching one I used to like, I've kind of realized it's not good. So. Best is probably Sat AM because I love that one. Sounds I good. Yeah. That. Sounds good. And wor worst, I don't, I don't want to say the one I used to love is the worst, but oh, I may, ha I might have to. Sonic X, Sonic X, Sonic X, Sonic X. Sonic Underground. Underground. Uh, under Underground, man. <laughs> Underground's so garbage. I used to love Underground and rewatching it. My god, it was not good. Oh, oh my god. Dude, there was like this <laughs> one fucking scene. It's like this I made a whole one, fucking like... video on that shit. On that dude, shit. And there's like this one, one fucking point. scene yeah. in Underground with Knuckles. Dude, like there was like this one scene where he was like fucking floating in like for two seconds. And then like Sonic gets all bigger for some reason. 
<laughs> it's so Tom. weird. The, f look at the fucking the fucking theme song carried that show, man. That's like the one reason right, I right, right, right. Rev, Rev, I want to know this. <laughs> Rev, who's your celebrity crush? And thank you guys so much for watching the shit cast. We've been going for like almost wow. an, for almost two hours now. So I'm, I'm it's like uh, an hour and fifty right now. So anyway, guys, I hope you really like this tenth episode. Uh, you know.